use the tool, I really guarantee it will save you hours, hours of management and leadership time. And more importantly, really help to unleash the potential of the talent that you have around you. The one thing that uh, unites the business leaders and the thousands of business leaders that we've coached around the world is, is this fear of delegating but losing control. Uh, in other words, there is an inherent fear that by letting go of a key task or activity or project, we'll, you know, we'll find that this thing is not carried out and executed properly. And this can lead to the director or the leader to start to interfere, to dilly dally involved, get involved within the project and asking for you know emails, updates on a regular basis. And that just can be demoralizing for the person you've delegated to or the project leader. So I want to introduce you to a quick three-step process, which I hope will ensure that you're able to delegate effectively whilst maintaining control and awareness of the task. And this three-step process involves the key headings of what, why, who, how, and when. The what and the why part of the process defines the project and more importantly sets the context of what why it is important, the metrics and goals that you want to be achieved in the project. And the who and the how part of the three-step process. This helps you to really discuss, more importantly, you know, who the team members are as part of the project and helps you to get comfort that hopefully the task will be implemented the right way and that the key people are involved. The when part is where you get control. You see, by identifying the end dates with the person that you're delegating to or the project leader and starting to work backwards within the project, set interim review dates where just you and the delegated individual will have the opportunity to review the project, you know, allow you to really assess how things are going and ensure that things are on track. And more importantly, it gives you time that if necessary, you need to jump in and get things done, you can get things done. And that saves you from getting involved every little time during the project. That's really important. Um, and it also will save you that crisis management situation. We've all been there where we ask how things are going at the very last minute. We get the bad news. It's not happening. And then we try the Superman approach to try and correct it. It ain't going to happen. So I hope this helps. Use the tool. I really guarantee it will save you hours, hours of management and leadership time. And more importantly, really help to unleash the potential of the talent that you have around you. Thank you.